Now, as we start the new year, health is at the top of so many people's minds as we try to turn the corner on this pandemic. Dr. Jen Ashton joins us now with a look at what we can expect in 2021. Dr. Jen, great to have you this morning. You know, our health priorities totally changed in 2020. Now in the new year, we have a vaccine that can give us so much hope. How do you think our health priorities change more? Well, Tom, I think that the silver lining, if you will, in the past year is that it's really brought to the forefront, yes, as you said, a refocusing on health and wellness and prevention of disease, but it's also introducing this concept of how to assess risk versus benefit, not just in terms of whether or not someone should get the vaccine, but literally whether or not we should go to the grocery store, whether or not we should get together with friends and family. So to go through that risk versus benefit it's really pretty straightforward I want to encourage people to learn how to think like a doctor four questions you want to ask what's the risk of doing something what's the risk of not doing something what's the benefit of doing something and what's the benefit of not doing something so let's take your blueprint and let's put the vaccine there and again remind our viewers why it's so important yeah. to take this vaccine Okay, so, you know, a lot of people, and rightly so, Tom, are saying, well, the risk of death of COVID-19 for all comers is relatively low. That's true. But you also have to assess the risk of long-term COVID syndrome, which is thought to occur 30% of the time, um, producing potentially debilitating side effects. So that's a real risk. And then the risk, not just to you, but to those around you, to your ability to earn a living, to go to work, et cetera, et cetera. So that goes under risks of not getting the vaccine. Risks of the vaccine, let's take allergic reaction, less than around one per one million doses overall um, for other vaccines. And you know the risk of a short-term side effect, anywhere from 10 to 30%, like fatigue, muscle aches, that's not too serious. Benefits of getting the vaccine, 94, 95% reduction in risk of getting COVID-19. Benefits of not getting it, kind of a question mark. So when you ask those four questions, you get four good answers that can help guide your decision. Dr. Jen, staying at home, so much anxiety over COVID-19, it's affected the way people eat. What tips do you have for about, about the way people eat and what they should do going into the new year? Well, it sure has, Tom, and you know that I also have a degree in nutrition. Um, I think people should think about the four S's in their eating plan this year. Things should be safe, simple, sustainable, and they should focus on that added sugar. So turn those packages around, look at added sugar. For women, it should be no more than 25 grams a day. For men, about 36 grams of added sugar a day maximum. Okay, finally, Dr. Jen, 2020 has been so rough. We are so excited that things will change in 2021, but we do have to talk about mental health because it's affected nearly all of us, right? I mean, being at home, dealing with the Absolutely. loss of life, living in fear of, of COVID-19. How do we get through this year? All those effects, very real. People are saying that this might be the second pandemic of mental illness, things like PTSD, anxiety, depression, um, up dramatically. I think we need to remember, check up from the neck up. It's okay to not be okay, and reach out for help from a trained mental health professional, social worker, psychologist, psychiatrist. Just talk about your feelings. We are all experiencing these feelings to one extent or another, and it's okay. Always better to talk about them. Dr. Jen, thank you for all that you've done for us and for our viewers. Happy New Year. Here's to a much better Thanks, 2021. Tom. You too. Happy all New right. Year. All right. Happy New Year. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.